Uh, female privilege. Hey, man. I uh, love your podcast. Hope your family's doing great. Thank you. Thank you very much. Wasn't that nice of you? My family is doing great. My daughter is awesome. And my wife, I have a whole new level of love for watching her be a mom. Aw. Have a read at this article when you get a chance. Um, okay. Female nurse found guilty of dangerous driving, causing death to be sentenced. Do I want to read this? There aren't any kids involved in this. Is this come on? We already saw a potential scam. Okay. BC nurse found guilty of dangerous driving, causing death sentenced to 90 days in jail. The families of two young people are angry over a dangerous driving sentence, giving the woman who killed them. Okay, the BC nurse found guilty of dangerous driving, causing death of two people has been sentenced to 90 days in jail. Andalina Hesimovic was driving at high speeds through pet, pit meadows in October 2010. She ran a red light, jumped a concrete median, and slammed into a car carrying Becky Dyer, 19, and Johnny D. Oliveira, 21. The couple who were on their way home from a concert were killed instantly. Along with the 90-day sentence, Hesimovic also received two years probation, 120 hours of community service, and three years driving probation. Um, she will serve her sentence intermittently between Tuesdays and Thursdays around her work schedule. Oh, my God. What a joke. Dyer's mother, Debbie, said this sentence is not showing the public that our justice system actually is a justice system. It's actually a legal system. It's not going to deter other drivers from doing the same. Oh, my God. D. Oliveira's mom, Audrey, echoed the same sentiment. Six years is a long time. She's put everybody through, and she's only getting a little bit here, a little bit there. It's wrong. Yeah, that's terrible. That's fucking terrible. That's fucking horrible. You know, at some point when you're driving that fast, you do, I mean, I think those laws are all going to change. I know they have with drunk driving. I think because she wasn't drunk and jails are all filled up, at least in this country, like, I, I don't understand that. But, I mean, your life should be tremendously affected. If you were, if you were driving that fucking fast and then killed two innocent people, I think the whole, well, she's never committed a crime. She's a nurse. She's a productive member of society. I think a lot of that goes out the fucking window. Well, she did something tremendously stupid, and now two people are dead forever. So at the very least, you can do 90 straight days in jail. What do you say there? And, and yeah, I guess you'll have to figure out what you're gonna, how you're going to find another job after that. What kind of cool job does she have? I have to be on jail. I have to be in jail on Tuesday and Thursdays because I killed two people. On Tuesday, I go to jail for the woman I killed. On Thursday, I go to jail for the guy I killed. So, like, can I work, like, Monday? Not Wednesdays because I'll be, like, so tired from being in jail for one day. Um, can I work, like, Monday, Friday, Saturday, and a half day Sunday? Uh, that's, yeah, that's disgusting. Fucking disgusting.